Morning, Saturday. We're going to try to get a couple more hours in to our outdoor Arlington gazebo. Jess is already working on the instructions and flip you around. We've laid out the roof sections facing each other, peak to peak, and we will start putting the sheeting on and see how far we get today. It is awful windy. I'm really sorry about the wind noise. Um, in the future we'll do something about that. But uh, we're going to see if we can get the roof on today and we'll see how much time we have total invested in this project. Stay with us.
sad to tell you, we've got about 25 hours in uh, this so far. But we're just about done. Some uh, minor finishing touches, primarily just just uh, loving on the dog. I guess uh, Rigby is ready to get into the fields doing some planting. <laughs> but anyway, we got it just about done. A few finishing touches. We got the uh, roof ridge to put in yet. And we uh, are firm believers at this point that the instructions forgot to tell us that two people can put this together in 18 hours if they have a tractor with hydraulics that they can put the roof on because there's no way you're going to pick that roof up with uh, two people and get it square. So we're all done for today. We'll pick this up tomorrow and I think that uh, we're going to start pouring cement also. Sunday day six I believe and we're going to try to put a little lipstick on this and make it purdy. Uh, going to put uh, some drip edge on today and the eave cap. And I think after that, we are going to go right into cement. Looks good. Rained a little bit last night. Kind of slowed getting started today. But uh, we are quickly running out of pieces. If we uh, work on it for about an hour today, it should settle in right at about 26 hours. And I know we're uh, real happy to see this one in. There's more parts to putting this together than there is a high tunnel. Although the directions might be a little better. There's an app on your phone that actually talks you through it. Unfortunately, it's all in Japanese. And No, just kidding. Oh, we'll get going, speed this up for you, and uh, wish us luck.
about, it looks like we're just about done. 26 hours is what it took. So a little over what the estimation was on the instructions. Um, looks pretty good. We've got a couple of pieces to touch up that we banged up. We bought some stain yesterday. We're going to stain um, the packing shed as well to hopefully somewhat match. Uh, at least a little bit closer than the ugly yellow with the brown and then touch up the pieces that we banged up um, now we're gonna get stuck started on building the frame for the cement floor although I don't know if the weather is gonna cooperate with us the weather this spring has been awful for doing anything we're pretty happy with how it turned out. If you're familiar with how we've had this set up in the past, it was kind of a janky tent that any time the wind got above a certain mile per hour, we usually ended up chasing it into the field or it bent all up um, and it just was starting to look pretty rough. So this is much better. We have quite a bit much more quite a bit more selling space we were just talking about. I'm trying to come up with some fun ideas to make it look better. Leo wants fairy lights, but we'll see. Um, so that's about it for today. We're just going to go ahead and make the form for the cement floor. And uh, see if we can start using our new fancy cement mixer today. Although, the, like I said, the clouds are kind of telling me otherwise. We'll see. Have a good day.